Hello Dragons, we're really excited to be here today. This is Katie, I'm Kirsty, we're both jewellers and together we created the Workbench London. Today we're asking for £50,000 of investment for a 10% share of our business. In front of you, you have one of a kind ring making kits and the concept is simple. Designed and carved at home, cast and polished with us. Our rings are made using recycled solid silver and they're hand polished and cast in London. And we're really excited to find the right dragon to help us really grow the business and spread more sparkle. In front of you, you should have some yeah. kits and some rings. Have you got your kits? Ah. <laughs> uh -huh. Somewhere. Right. So we have given you a kit each. This is to display the range of products that we offer. You have got the diamond box. This allows you to have an ethically sourced diamond set in your ring that you design and make at home. So you have the online tutorials to show how you carve, carving away little tiny chips of the jeweler's wax. And you right. can only go very slowly because it is a hard plastic when you start off, so you can't go wrong like, oh my God. Right, yeah. Yeah. got it. And so when you come to the end of your um, carving, you may end up with something like this, um, a diamond shaped signet. That's what you send back to us. And then the casting company make a mold of the wax ring and offer a polishing service. And you can choose gold plating and engraving as well. Let, let's just talk about numbers. Yeah, yeah. You've got a valuation of a half a million pounds. Mm -hmm. So let's get these big numbers. What are they, ladies? OK, in 2018, we had a turnover of £129,000 with a net profit of £67,000. Yep. In 2019, we had a turnover of £137,000 yep. with a net profit of £70,000. And in 2020, we made £150,000 yep. with a net profit of £97,000. Right. Net so profit you... or gross profit? Net. net. Net profit. What was your gross profit in that? Yeah. Well, I know that our profit margin was about was 60. No, it's higher. It's now 72. Oh, God. Oh. We do have, the, we do have this information, but I know this isn't helpful now. Um, it's OK. Yeah. Um, so what was the numbers again? So it was 150 with 97. Do you remember that middle number? No. Is it 40 something? No, it's higher than that. Um, I can tell you our, m the rough sort of margin is 72% mm -hmm. on our best-selling kit. So that must be your gross profit, 97,000. Yeah, so you then. can't possibly have made that net profit. OK. Yeah. OK. Because oh. um, net profit is after you've taken all your expenses, your salaries, your overheads, your rent. Have you factored that into the 97,000 or no? Yeah, that is the net profit, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, that is the net profit. Yeah. This is really lovely and it comes out really well, but at the moment I'm, I'm surprised you've even got here because your numbers are appalling. Yeah, and we've that's been what working really concerns with an accountant, me. sorry. No, but it's, look, it's not OK, actually. Yeah. No, you're absolutely. coming in for investment and if you want money, you really worry me immediately because you're all over the place with your numbers. So. We really need to get to the bottom of those numbers. Yeah, OK. So what's your value of your current stock? So I guess I think in the workshop it's about £5,000. Yeah. And then 26 in the bank. So you've got 31000 You've got any other assets? No. Yes, you have. Can I answer? I've got a gold plating machine. <laughs> oh, yeah, right, yeah, 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 okay. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> That's an asset. <laughs> Sorry. Deborah, please come oh. up for an help. <laughs> You're likeable. You're likeable for sure. So, how much did you pay for the machine? It's about one thousand five hundred. And we've got polishing machines. And how much and were they? Four hundred and twenty pounds. And we've got two of those. So, two. That's yeah. another eight hundred. So that's thirty-three thousand five hundred. Yeah. yeah. So what's happened to the 90,000 profit that you've made? What have you done with it? Yes, fat and tax and things. Could be like travel as well, because there's lots of travel involved as... Lots of travel? So you travel by private jet? Or... <laughs> no. <laughs> so you think that you've been making 90,000 this year and 70,000 last year, but you've only managed to accumulate 33,000 yeah. pounds worth of net assets. Then you're probably only making 
five or 10,000 a year. The problem is, as an investor, when you're valuing your business at almost half a million pounds, at one end, it could be 97,000 pound profit, or you could be 10,000 pound profit. So, it, you know, you should have done your homework to basically understand where your net profit is, because as an investor, to make a decision, I need to know how healthy your financials are. So, I think you've shot yourself in the foot. Mm. Um, yeah. So, unfortunately, I can't invest. I'm out. You've come in here, and it was very, I was very enthusiastic with the product. I was very enthusiastic with your energy. And then all of a sudden, the whole business side just collapsed around you. So for that reason, I'm not going to invest, I'm out. OK, thank, thank you very much. much. Katie and Kirsty, your presentation, high-spirited, clearly yeah. it's great, but I think you've entered an environment and you need some real tough love because, mm. you know, it looks OK what you've done, but you've completely messed up. Mm. <sighs> so, yeah. sadly, I'm out. You have absolutely lost me on the business front. Mm. Listen, you could see I loved it, but this is so disappointing. Yeah. Because, like, Tosh says, I don't know how you value a business if we have no idea. Yeah. Unless there's a gut feeling. And Sarah, to my right, is in the position to understand the gut feeling. Hi. So I'm going to listen to Sarah. OK. I'm trying to piece together the bits of what you've told us. And I'm assuming the figures you quoted us were gross profit, not net profit. Okay. So you had 137,000 sales last year, but you'll have had a lot of expenses in paying for things like your rental, your travel. So for all you've made 70 gross profit, you've probably made very little net profit. I okay. can understand that. Yeah. Can't understand why you haven't made an awful lot more money this. Well, you might have done because you've got to the end of the year and you've got 30 grand in the bank, haven't you? Yeah. yeah. OK, yeah. I think I've got a pretty good picture of the business. With all due respect, I think I've probably got a better picture of your business now than what yeah. you've got. Yeah. Um, oh. But I think it's an exceptional product. Thank you. I think you're both very, very creative. I think you haven't got a business born between <laughs> you. Um, and if I was to invest yes. in this business today, I'm pretty sure I'd need to run your business for you. OK. So here is the offer I'd be prepared to make you. Right now, today, I would give you the 50000 that you need but in return, I would want 45% of mm. the business, which gives me a majority share to get the business into some form of shape as a business. Once I get my money back, I will reduce to a 30% stake, which leaves you with 35% each. Mm. And I think that's fair yeah. based on the work I'm, I'm going to have to run this business for you. Thank you. Thank you very much for your offer. Thank you. So the bits you've got absolutely right today is you look like your product, you present really well, I get your energy, you got ever so slightly deflated in the middle there. <laughs> um, but I, I really like it. The issue I have is the time that you're going to need in terms of running the business. I'm afraid that's what's put me off. So you won't be getting an offer from me. Okay. I'm out. All right, do we need to chat? Shall we chat? Yeah. Just because it's tradition. Just because we're here. You and know, like you can see the trousers and the we shoes. We didn't know if we'd get this opportunity. <sighs> okay, so just... What do you think? Yes. <gasps> yeah? That was a bit quick. Basically, we yes. just went. We just yes. went. Yes. Yes. yes, yes, yes. Just to make sure that we were definitely on the same page, which we normally are. Yes, please. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. Good decision. Thank you. Wow.